Hello everybody and welcome back to the GBAP. The Mighty Ducks of Anaheim currently sit at a record of 31, 25, and 7. We are 20th in the league and Gibson is doing a lot of the carrying. As you can see, our stats are pretty gross. However, this is our first NHL season, so our record isn't terrible actually. The save percentage, I would like to get it to 900, but we're hovering around there, which is at least somewhat acceptable. I think. The plan is to finish the season in this episode. So if we go to the calendar here, we passed the trade deadline. I don't think we really did anything, actually. I'm pretty sure that our team stayed the exact same. But yeah, there's not a whole lot of games left. We'll finish it easily. These are the games right here we have to win, though. We're going up against the Islanders, who are 31st in the league. They have 22 wins right now. It's imperative that we win this hockey game. So as you do, let's start the simulation and hope that it goes in our favor and we aren't heading into the third down by one or two, three, whatever it could be. Let's go, Ducks. Power play early on, nothing. We're out shooting them though, big time. 14 to two in the shots. What is going on? Finally, our third power play of the period and we get a goal, Ryan Strom, beautician. Great way to start the second. Look home. That pads the lead a little bit. Another power play goal. Isaac buries one. And now we have a fairly comfortable lead. Okay. Well, Kyle Palmieri had something to say about that. And he just gave us the worst lead in hockey. I won't go into that bit again. I know I've already brought it up twice, but I'll stop. So on that screen, the loading screen where it shows you all the X factors, somehow... The Islanders have obtained John Carlson. I don't know how they pulled that one off, but they sure did. Anders Lee enters the zone for the Islanders, and that will be picked off by one Jamie Drysdale. Okay, what were the, the lessons that I learned? I gotta go into Butterfly more when it's up close like this. I gotta actually hold Butterfly, because I think my problem before was I was just strictly focusing on positioning and not worrying at all about the whole vertical aspect. I was strictly horizontal. We are all over this team right now. Nice passing. Barzell gets it though and headmans it to Lee, who is coming back in our zone. Goes to rip one. It's blocked. All right, I see you. Oh, didn't see that. All right, well, our lead has diminished to one. First shot I face and it's that. You have got to be kidding me. All right, thank you. At least I got to make a save. So I'm one for one. Or I guess I should say one and one. One for two. Yeah, that makes more sense. Give me some more saves here. Rodriguez goes for a little TDR, but failed. Oh, Rodriguez, sit down. Well, whoever that was is going to be sitting down. Ryan, come on, man. I am not a fan. Of the fact that they already knew 14 was right there. I really did want to pass that out. Whoa! I'm going to trap you. Yeah. You're not going anywhere, buddy. What happened? Oh, offside. Ha <laughs> ha! Gotcha. You know what? Other than that first goal, it's been an all right start. Have I only made one save, I think? Or maybe two? Now three? And that was one that I should not have made. Because the whole net was wide open. All those things are true. Whoa! A shot from Carlson. Got the blocker on it, but barely. Enough to keep it out, though. Oh, Barzell! Tried to load one top blocker. And yeah, our blocker is looking pretty good right now. I can't lie. Okay, let's drop into Butterfly. And we managed to get it out. Is the power play done? I think it is. Whew! What a relief. Butterfly? Yeah, there we go. All right. I think I'm learning. That could have been a big hit. Come on, Trevor. Look at this passing. Are you kidding me? That was beautiful. All right, Carlson. Let's see what you got. You guys got shut out in the season opener. The Capitals, that is. Unbelievable. Ooh, again, that hit looked like it could have been way worse than it was. For some reason, I thought I heard a whistle, but no. All right. That was a lot. Everything that just happened was intense. All right. The Isles back in. They really like those passing plays. 
but we just got saved. I think our team is starting to catch on, which is great because I don't save those like ever. No way. For what? Strom again? Fine, we've been over this. <laughs> Deja vu. All right. What's going on? Show me what he did. That's weak, ref. JG Pajot again goes for the pass in the middle, but McGinn has been watching on the iPad from the bench. <laughs> he knew. Go! Skate, Isaac. His controller disconnected, apparently. Right into the middle. Can we get it? Wait, yeah, those need to be fixed. That is brutal. They're back in. Yeah. And he does it again. It did get over the blue line, thankfully. Or did it? Well, it's out now. So that's all that matters. We have killed off yet another power play for the Islanders. There's three minutes left. And yeah, you know what? I feel like we've looked pretty good other than that first goal, which I can't even really blame myself for. Sure, I could have maybe seen that coming, but it was just a good goal. <laughs> that was scary. Barely got a piece of that, but just enough to make it go wide. Rodriguez! What a bullet! Wasn't scared. Why do you guys want this win so bad? Tank for a draft pick. Get out of here. Oh, it's the last minute nonsense. This is usually where things go sour. But I made a pretty nice save off of the point shot there. Trevor. Killing some time. I like it. The Islanders do manage to get the puck back, though. 30 seconds remaining, and here comes Noah Dobson. Goes for the cross-ice pass, but Trevor read him like a book. Saw it coming. Look at this guy go. He's got heart. He is doing everything he can to ensure that the Mighty Ducks walk out of here with a double V. Ooh, so close. They're going to get one final attack here. Horvat gets by his guy, rips one, and send it out. That should be GG, no re. That is a win that we need. Because again, we're sort of on the bubble right now. All the points count. Not going to lie, did not expect to get all green there. Big fan. Thank you, coach. Appreciate it. Another massive game here because they are 32nd. We can't let these ones slip. Come on, Ducks. 33. That is two massive games. Now we have the Wild. They're 10th. Yeah, this is going to be a tough one. But can Gibson pull it off? He does. Holy crap. Look at that. I mean, yeah, we're one game up on them, two up on them, but still, the dream is alive. And we have the 19th placed Winnipeg Jets, our next opponent. Let's go ahead and start the sim here. I'm going to just play three games and then sim the rest is what is my current strategy. Times eight, go Ducks. You can always tell when there's going to be a goal before it actually shows up because the timer sort of pauses like that. <laughs> Leeson! Fire me vertical. Oh dear. Wheeler. What are these rosters, man? I updated before we started this. Be a pro. Whatever. It is what it is. Shots are fairly even. Will we see another goal before the third? Or will we have a tied scenario? It is the latter. Let's get in there. Obviously, this is old news at this point. But the Jets did sign Shifley and Hellebuck to identical contracts. And a lot of people thought they were going to get moved. It's still possible, I guess. But, yeah. That was sort of shocking. Nice pass. Oh, good try. But Bucky was there for that one. All right. It's a pretty fast start here. No way he gets a breakaway. But he also gets... It worked. Save from the point. Oh dear, I, that was that was bad. Shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Thankfully, the game has not punished me yet. Actually, I would have rather it happened there than in the playoffs or something. Wait a minute. That's I follow, and I think I saw PLD as well. So what is going on? How'd they get Blake? Did they just trade to get Blake Wheeler back or something? 
I don't know, man. Or wait, no. I did not see PLD. Yeah, because he went to LA and Ayafalo came back. And there's a couple other... Like, did they get more as well as part of that? Or no, what was the deal again? All I know is that Ayafalo came to the Jets and PLD went to the Kings. And there was some other pieces in there. Beautiful hit. Crowd's getting behind us here. Oh! They're still chanting. They did not give up. And now we go to the penalty kill. Come on, man. What are we doing? Do you guys want to be in the playoffs or not? Oh! Wait a minute. It's Velarde. Yeah, okay. I just saw him. So, clearly that trade is here. Yes! All right, we managed to kill that off, I think. No, never mind. Zegris is still in there. But now it's four on four for a short period of time. And then we have the man advantage. Oh, it's literally one second. So basically, we just have a power play. Shifley somehow managed to make that work. Once again, the weakest dump of all time. You absolute legend. Made that look easy. Walked around one guy, came into the middle, and just tucked it home. Look at this. Sees his defender. Bye. And boom. Let's go. 2 1. All right, Nikolai, I see you. Ooh. Thought you had it, didn't you? Probably not. Wasn't really a great chance, but they saved it. Oh, no. He had the entire net. I have just been given a gift. Hold butterfly, hold butterfly. Holy crap, get up please. That was a lot. And for that I'm fighting Hellebuck. Makes perfect sense, right? Ah, get there. Okay, never mind. We should be I love how slow. I do you think speed would improve that or do you think goalies just skate really slow in this? Anyway, here we go. I have yet to be taken down and I do not plan on having that happen here today. Go for the uppercut. You won't. And... Oh, he didn't. But he still gets dodged. Oh, okay. I see you. And... And... You're done. You are done, sir. Oh! Okay. You know what? He's putting up a good fight. Credit to you, Bucky. Shifley, I swear on my life. That was a weird shot. I'll take the stat, though. Whoa! I have no idea how whatever just happened happened. It's not a goal. All right, I need to know. So he gets it. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, that just went off a bunch of stuff. It went off his stick. Never mind, that's it. It literally just went off his stick. And... Okay. Cool. Guys, I'm a genius. I'm gonna name this video Fighting for a Playoff Spot. And this is gonna be my thumbnail. Come on. It's pretty good. Nice try, Morrissey. Other than the fact that it wasn't. Four on four action remains here. Perfetti goes cross ice to Pionk. Oh! Get destroyed! Pass it out to Cam Fowler. Ryan Strom, you gotta make up for those penalties you took last game. That is unacceptable. And I will not be having it. Perfetti went for like a low shot. Okay! I feel like that's way closer than it should have been. Morrissey. Put it down low and Perfetti ended up losing it. I love how he's just chasing after him with his hands up like this. Oh, it's too good. I see you. I don't know who that guy is, but I like him. Sparks are flying in this heated battle. Nice try. Go backhand. Why didn't you go backhand though? Come on, sevens. Well, Trevor is a joke. Shorthanded. Up by one. Not much time left. Okay, okay. Yup. Um, cover that. My goalie didn't even, like, react to that, I feel like. Screw it. No, what am I doing? <laughs> that was the worst decision I have made yet. I'll probably top it eventually, but I, I should smarten up. That was awful. Yeah, right, Cole. Okay, he was kind of open there. Look home. 
Niederreiter catching the pop fly along the boards. Now they have Kubalik starting out from the Jets zone. Perfetti ends up losing it, but Kubalik once again manages to get it back just to go offside. Love that for me. Less than a minute to go. Come on, Ducks. We can do this. Perfetti is back in. Gets it over to Nino, who has his shot blocked. Ooh, that looked a little dirty to me. I don't know. I'm not a referee or anything. But I'm just saying. <laughs> the empty net shots kill me, especially that one. Because he sent that thing. All right, cool. JD with the empty netter. And he's going to slide on an empty netter. <laughs> and the Ducks walk away with yet another win. Absolutely incredible stretch from the Ducks. They had 48 shots? We're the best goalie ever. And comes up clutch to deliver sure did. and lead his team to victory. How about yeah. that? All right, to the phones we go. We got uh, I don't care about the phones. Get me out of here. Uh, sorry, Brendo. Shouldn't have cut you off like that. I didn't know he was going to send it over to you. Um, Look at that. Look at that. I wonder if that brings our overall save percentage above. This is incredible. Come on, Gibson. We need a win over the Blues here. They are 26th. They are out of the playoff picture. And we don't get one. That's unfortunate. Next up, Minnesota Wild. How many games do we have left? I'm going to play this one and then we will just sim the rest of the season. Yeah, there's not a whole lot left. So we'll play this and the rest will be simulated. Hopefully, we make it in. It's worth noting that we are... Currently 11th in the league. Oh, come on, Erickson. Heck, no! Get out of here! We got the first goal and I was... Can we chill? Like, give me a second to breathe here. That was outrageous. I felt like every shot was going in. Okay. 3-2. Don't you dare. If I see Erickson X face pop up... Okay, at least it wasn't right after. But instead we get Felino. 4-3. Well, my save percentage is dropping right back below that 900. Come on, guys. Can we tie it up? No, we can't. All right, going into the third, down by one. This is our first time in this... Well, okay then. Oh, look who it was. Of course. He has my number right now, clearly. So it doesn't look like we're gonna win this one. It's still possible. Definitely not in our favor at the moment. With that big winning streak we went on there, I mean, it wasn't really that big. It was like probably four games. But anyway, we kind of gave ourselves a bit of a cushion. Not much, you know, like we can afford to lose this game, but we are still certainly floating in the bubble. Wilson, same shot twice, pretty much. Glove stop on both of them, and he is fuming, clearly. Because he just rocked whoever that was. Nice try with the cross crease pass. Unfortunately, it did not get through. Mason loses it. Five minutes? Can I fight their goalie at the same time? Is that a thing? Will he go me? Am I able to? Oh, let's go! Wait, no, no. Surely not. I thought the camera wasn't gonna move and I was gonna lose. I don't wanna. Oh my, okay, I... oh wow, we have some serious damage control. I don't even know what's going on either. I literally can't let him hit me again, I don't think. All right, okay. This is terrifying. This is terrifying. No. Yes? Come on. I need one more, I feel like, and he needs one more. Come on. Yes. Holy crap. They had me in the first half. I'm not gonna lie. Oh wait, it's not even a, I guess it was just the five minute fighting major, I guess. Cause no one's on the power play. All right, we take that. Flurry, I'm really sorry. All right, 
You accepted the challenge, though. That was 100% the closest we have been to losing. I am so sure of it. <laughs> what is going on? No! Get rid of the puck, man! Oh, they still have it. They are still on the attack here. Thank you, Cameron. I take it back. I take my thank you back! You're brutal. Well, this game got out of control. Like, really fast. You gonna, you gonna do anything there, guy? Or are you just gonna stand in front of the net pretending to do something? Oh, this is not a good game from Anaheim. I'm not playing well. The team isn't playing well. But again, if it's gonna happen, I'm glad that it is the last game of the video. Yeah, right. You think you can dent the Stanley Cup and then score on me? You're probably right. You, you would score. But I just managed to save that one. Troy Terry gets it down low to Frankie. Okay. I like the puck movement. Not a big fan of that shot. Even during your windup, he was already down, so you should have known that thing was not getting through. This is once again one of those games where it's just kind of like, get me out of here. <laughs> We're down by three. There's still half the third period left, basically. Another big hit. This game has been full of them. Good try, Lindstrom. Appreciate you. Flowers just on one. I feel like losing that fight fired him up. Look at this guy go. Oh my word. Yep, just a little shot there. I uh, thought was going higher than it was, clearly. And it went blocker down. Instead of bar down, it was blocker down. Wilson really wants to score on that club side. How's that working out for you, pal? Huh? Oh my word. Can you pull me? Get me out of here. This has gotten out of hand. Oh, there we go. I did get pulled. And I also just got hat-tricked on. Don't even- I don't even want to be on the bench. I'm leaving. I'm out of here. That was disgraceful. We have the last place Chicago Blackhawks up next. Please, Gibson. Thank you. I think I'm gonna sim from the calendar, but let's see. So right now we are 14th in the league. Really? That fast? That's central. Where are we in the Pacific Division? Okay, we are... Mm, Two games on us, though. It's gonna be a close one. I'm gonna take it one week at a time, so we are currently in a four-game week here. I will sim up to the Vancouver Canucks. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. We're not making playoffs. Sim to the next week here against the Blues, and okay, that's a big win. There's another L. Sixth in the division. Yeah, I think we just sealed our own fate, essentially. The St. Louis Blues is an L. We're still sixth, which, yeah, we're two points back. Shootout loss, okay. We need a win here, and we might. Excuse me, sir. We're going up against the Golden Knights that currently have 52 wins, so that's fun. And we have 90 points, but what does it look like in the conference do we stand a chance i feel like no wait no we don't we're out nope we can still get in oh yeah no we can't we're done the team about to win the president's trophy will they get 53 wins i was about to say 35 <laughs> oh man yeah it's about that time i think uh i think this episode is concluding so the regular season has completed let's look at the stats here and see what players performed and which ones didn't hopefully our overall goes up to like at least 78 for next season that will help out and the golden knights did go on to win the president's trophy with 52 w's and 110 points wow wow we got finessed that is ridiculous. Also, I think that means we beat the Golden Knights at the end there. They might not have been starting everybody because it was the last game of the season. Didn't really matter, but who knows? Anyway, Trevor was point a game. Troy Terry was nearly there. Strom had 66. 
Only 24 penalty minutes and half of those were in that one game. Again, Gibson did well and I kind of held the team back here with these stats. That digs deep. That Hoyts. Elvis was the league leader for W's. He also had a 915. Jake Yeo with a 922 and 40 wins. Great year from him. EK65 led defenseman with 88 points. And then Roman Yossi had 75. And your Art Ross winner will be Connor McDavid with what looks like a Rocket Richard winning Austin Matthews. Okay, let's just sim to wherever it takes us. NHL season is completed. Yep. I'm just gonna kind of store these for now and then we will deal with that next season. And the Stanley Cup goes to the Buffalo Sabres. We get pick number 16 and 15. Back to backs. That's good, I guess. I wonder if Sim to next big event sort of bypasses meetings and stuff or not. Maybe we're just not getting anything because it is the off season, blah, blah, blah. Maybe it does though? Uh, no, I doubt it. All right, we are up to a 77 overall. Let's just look at the awards real quick. So, ooh, Zegris, 90 overall. Here you go, the team awards and individually, McDavid with the Art Heart combo, EK with the Norris and the Lady Bing. Uh, Nicolition gets the Calder. Great. Darlene with the Con Smythe. The 88 by eight man. That is a good contract, I think. I hope. If you're a Sabres fan, let me know what you think. Jake Yo gets the Vesna. Leonard with the Jennings. Siegenthaler gets the Bill Masterton. Kobitar, Selkie, and we know the Rocket Richard. Ted Lindsay checks out. All right, the skill tree. We only got two trait points here. Is there anything that will actually bring our attribute up to the next stage? Does not look like it. No, that's not even close. No. Definitely not doing dialogue. Oh. Yeah, give me some more speed. Maybe the other ones were bringing me up and I just didn't realize it. All right, let's sim past the preseason. Have a look at the lines for our upcoming... The whole narrative and the expression being good in the room, right? You know, chemistry is important with a team. You know, how many times have we seen okay. teams that are absolutely yeah. stacked with yeah. talent and they fall apart? Why? Because there was just a disconnect within the room. Oh. And I know with some reporters and some of the media members asking the kid, saying, hey, you know what, why, well, how, do you, how do you endear yourself to teammates more? I don't. I don't know if there's ever all. really an answer. I mean, you can go out and, you know, try to be the best player you can be. That's one way to do it. That is you one know, way to do it. Personally, a great point. I think another great way to do it is buying everybody pizza. Because, you know who likes pizza? Everybody. That's not right? true, actually. I know everybody someone who doesn't pizza. like pizza. Let's go back to the um, here. Let's go to Brent. This one gives me the option or the chance to get two. And how he played last okay, James. Year in goal. A 910 and mean, a 910. Or want, I could go for the. No, I'm going for the double. So, by the looks of it, we have the chance to get a lot of abilities here. And what a preseason. Not that it matters because it is preseason. I'm not going to ignore it, though. Two hours of training left, sure. Just throw it on something. I don't know, five hole. Actually, no, let's do glove. Not that our glove needs training, based on that Tom Wilson experiment, but do it anyway. Moment of truth. Let's view the lines and see what our squad looks like coming into this year. Honestly, I expected it to look a little bit better than this. Zegris playing with Mason. Didn't he have abilities last year? Did he lose them? And then Vitrano, Barabanov, Terry, and DeBrusk. Our third line is unreal. And then we've got this Sasha guy. Must have impressed the coach. In the preseason. Defense, Fowler and Pesci. Hannafin and Drysdale. Okay. I like it. Defensive core looking strong. We still got Gibber for three years. And Scott. Yeah. All right. You know what? Oh, I think it's going to be a good year. I just have a feeling. So we will get started with season number two in the next one. Why did my pads change again? Why? Well, I appreciate you guys. Hopefully you're enjoying the NHL season so far. Hopefully you're enjoying this series so far. And yeah, if you could leave a like, that'd be fire. I will see you soon.